Morning folks, uh, Bones here, just a very quick video on uh, setting up jigs for the fibre laser. If anyone's got a fibre laser machine, you know, especially if they're a newbie, they might find this little section interesting. I'm still learning, so this is my solution so far. So, flat engraving is not a problem at all. You can just place your item on the, on the, on the plate here, line it up with the light and uh, centre it by eye really. Unless you've got batch production, then you would probably make a jig. The problem I had is want to do quite a lot of rotary engraving like this. And the rotary attachment I got with my machine, the mounting holes, don't line up with the bloody machine. So you can't centre your dot up using those mounting holes. Or at least I couldn't figure out how to do it. So it's a bit annoying really so I'm not really sure if this attachment was made for a different machine or if they're all a bit sort of generic I, I, I imagine they're quite generic but anyway there's always a fix for these prompt things in there so all I've done is I've cut myself some strip some 25 mil aluminium strip I've made a, uh, a, a what's it called an oblong slot in each end on both of these and then I've centred up the laser light and fix this back one now obviously this is a bit slack and a bit loose at the minute all I need to do is when I when I use this machine is push the rot rotary attachment up to the channel there and then you see there's a little gap there when I want to fix it down I just push that in with my left hand and just nip it up with my right and it fixes it which hasn't done it there because I haven't got full force on it but then now it locks it that way and it stops it moving that way. What I was finding at first is if I just held this rotary attachment on here as the machine was jogging round to do its different lettering the whole thing would slew round very slowly so I'd end up with letters going all over the place. Uh, it didn't take me long to figure that what was happening there but uh, this is a, a quick fix and I think it's a bit easier than having um, little machine vices on here and setting it up every time you want to use it so now I know it's exactly the right place when I come to uh, when I come to use it and obviously this one couldn't come off and these other fittings are just to uh, put square plate in and stuff like that so that's all I've done so far on the machine if you've got any other ideas or if you're new to fibre lasing yourself and you've got ideas which may help me give us a shout put the, put some comments down below what I want to do as well is make machine a channel in this and make a fixture that screws in into it uh, which I can slide along at any given point I think that'd be quite handy for square and plate material as well but it's all a uh, it's all a learning process and you just uh, you, you make it up as you go along don't you with these things and uh, eventually you get to a good point where it kind of works for your needs but that's a good start if uh, anyone like I say if anyone's got any ideas give us a shout below point me in the right direction of other jigs and fixtures I'm all ears but uh, that's it for now for this quick introduction of the, the new fiber laser cheers folks see ya